Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Friday Night Showdown live in Anaheim, California in Honda Center. As the show continues to roll, um, we got some new greetings from those robots from outer space. And those are the Decepticons joining the War of the Universe for the Battle of Dominance. And this War of the Universe is getting really interesting to see the Decepticons making impact after they attacked the four-time World Tag Team Champions of Mario and Luigi. Boy, folks, this is going to be really awesome, isn't it? This War of the Universe is getting really awesome to watch after what we just seen last match. Well, ladies and gentlemen, let's take you to something important message after what happened before the show even began to air. Um, this person came out of the ring and now says that who, who is the attacker of Princess Peach from last episode of Warzone? Well, ladies and gentlemen, this attacker is actually her in the ring. Here it is. And there you have it. This is what's going to happen, ladies and gentlemen. Iris the Cat was responsible in the ring as she exposed herself that she was responsible for attacking Princess Peach. And then she challenged Princess Peach to a match tonight. And later on, in the backstage, Princess Peach says she accepts a, accepts a match against Iris the Cat. After all the runs she had of all the great things she has been accomplished throughout her life, she's going to risk, risk herself big that she hasn't risk before since Road to Glory, as you all remember how that happened. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I believe it's almost time for a match. So here we go. Princess Peach taking on Iris and Cat, and I am ready for this one. That crazy girl. No one's ever going to face Iris again because she's a crazy one. She attacked her not once, but twice on Peach. As you all remember what happened on the Superstars, I believe, or the main event, Iris and Cat attacked her and this is her second time she attacked Princess Peach. For now, she's going to end this one once and for all. Will Princess Peach beat that lunatic girl from Japan? It's crazy, I know. No one wants to face her because she's too scary to fight. But Princess Peach is not afraid. And there she is. Coming down to the ring, ladies and gentlemen. As we're ready for the match to see how Peach can handle this lunatic girl from Japan. What kind of name is Iris the Cat? 
I'm gonna name after that freaking whatever that Disney cat is, Cheshire the cat. Oh, please don't tell me she's gonna reference that cat. Or I would not imagine a other cat like Lucifer the cat. I know everybody hates that cat. If you never heard this cat, go go watch Cinderella. And Princess Peach. She's not even afraid, so wishing her the best of luck and Yep. Here she comes. Out of nowhere, the lunatic cat! Look at this crazy cat person ready to come down to the ring. Ready to face Princess Peach tonight here in Showdown Live in Anaheim. Remember, this cat is no playing matter. This girl knows how to play the lunatic tricks behind her sleeves. Any weird moves, you gotta beware. Most courageous person in this wrestling business today. Just look at that! Look at this! Alright, this is what they... Look at Pete! I never see she gets that confidence like this. Here we go! This might be one of the most important match since Road to Glory, and here comes... Princess Peach ready to fight. And she's off to a bad start as Peach gets knocked out of the ring. Iron's a cat! Oh boy. Talk about mis miscommunication of crash and burn from Iris the cat. Referee is going to three count. And Princess Peach back on her foot. Referee's on the four. And a book kick in the face. Peach got her. Oh, slap in the face right where she wants her. Vicious Peach. Close line with a start. Irish whip. But gets countered by Iris the cat with a power slam. Stomped on her chest by Iris the cat. She is from Osaka, Japan. Trained for almost three years. Now becoming a pro. Making her debut here in UCCW. Oh, good grief. What she be? I wonder if she trained by a, a crate. I wonder what wrestler she's been trained by. Like a legendary wizard we may never heard of before. Just look how crazy she is. It would be stupid with great Muda or something. What if it's Joey Ryan's? I would not imagine. Anyways. Throw us in a turnbuckle. Or some women from all Japan women's wrestling. Who could it be? Oh, look at this. Tree of Woe. Oh, missed the drop kick. Peach got it and did not get a connection onto Iris the Cat. Up to the turnbuckle. Oh, missed a double stomps. Close line again by Peach. Irish. Nope, never mind. And the elbow connects onto her chin. Peach. Oh, missed. Iris the Cat got her with a neck breaker. Uh oh. Slithering down, looking at her, ready for her next action. Got her with a gut buster. Now, Boston Crab connects. Peach in trouble. Let's see, can Peach fight through this one? Crawling. Can she make it? Uh, she's trying and she got it. Got the ropes. Irish whip. Oh, I mean a gut. Second time to gut here in this one. Oh, Peach is getting back up. Never going to get up. Oh, gets drop kick instead. Connecting the right target. Irish the cat picks her up. Oh! That was unexpected. Going for the pin. One, two, only two. Peach. Peach. Here comes a clothesline! There's that clothesline connected by Peach. The crowd's on her feet. Can she do it? Here we go! 
Is she going to do what I think she's going to do, ladies and gentlemen? No, she gets countered by Iron as a cat. Oh, no. Oh, not this way. There's that DDT. Here's a... Wait. She's not done yet. What's this? Oh! Osaka... Osaka Street Cutter. She went for the pin. Oh, come on, Peach. Come on. And she kicked out by two. Peach kicked out from the Osaka Stunner. That's the finisher's call, ladies and gentlemen. The Osaka Stunner from Japan. Because she's from Osaka, Japan. She calls this one the Osaka Stunner. Is that submission hold? And look at this crowd on their feet. We're cheering for Peach. They're going for Peach to win this match. It's like she's in favor to win this one over Iris the Cat. The crowd wants to see her to lose the mask. And they really want to see Peach win this one. But Iris the Cat managed to break through. And a third time in a row right in the gut. And a second time of that move. Picks her up. Iris. Oh! Shield herself by Peach. Neckbreaker. Nice move by Peach. She's going to go for this one. Oh! Missed. Ah, so many miscalculations from these ladies. And now Peach fights back. Peach. Nope. Uh-oh. Watch out. Oh! Bulldog. Springboard Bulldog by Iris the Cat picks her up. Now, what's she doing? Oh, she, oh no, come on, no, oh, come on. Oh, a DDT on the, oh, come on. Oh, oh, there's a third, come on, that replay is painful to watch. Vicious DT. Well, don't tell me she's gonna end like this. The referee's on a two. I don't think she's gonna make it. Uh, she's getting back up. Of course. Uh oh. Oh. Uh oh. What she had in mind? Oh, nice springboard moonsault outside the ring. This is something, dear lord, that Peach could ever make this one. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think we're. Can Peach make this one? Can she risk herself to win this one? As Showdown Live rolls on here on UCCW. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we welcome back to Friday Night Showdown Live. We're here in Anaheim, California, as this match continues on between Iris the Cat and Princess Peach. And the stipulation goes, if Princess Peach wins this one, Iris the Cat will force to remove her mask to expose her identity. This is something the crowd is dying to see. Who is this mysterious person 
behind a cat mask. You will not be surprised if it's Catwoman. That would be weird. This is a question that... This is a mysterious question that everyone is dying to hear. Who is this mysterious person? As we're going to find out right now. As Kral is in the favor of Princess Peach. Here tonight. There we go. What an incredible bulldog that was. And now... Oh, I think if she's going to do it... Oh, she got her! Peach Cake! On to Iron to Cat! Could this be it? The crowd's on her feet! No! Oh, she kicked out by two! Oh, we were so close to seeing the lose of Iron to Cat! To see who she really was! And a springboard missile drop kick! Iron to Cat's gonna steal the win too! No! Only two! Oh, this is getting interesting. Oh, Peach. Oh, Peach with a roll-up. Is she going to do it? No, we're getting two again. Oh. Oh, this is... Oh, drop kick. Knocking her outside the ring. Oh. Really intense from the guts from the fans. To see who's really Iris a Cat. Oh, springboard cross body onto Iris a Cat. Princess Peach is on fire! Getting really intense. The people are dying to see the victory of Princess Peach. We haven't seen her win for a long time in UCCW. Uh-oh, Iris the Cat is backed up. Ah, uh, Peach, be careful! Uh-oh, she got her eyes, but... Oh! Oh, no. She did something bad. Uh-oh! Ah! Oh, moonsault! Second time! Now Iris, Moonsault announce table, good grief. Oh no, the second time, oh! This time she escapes. Peach reverses it. The referee's on a four count. And now Iris, the cat. Oh dear, not this, not again, not a DT. But Peach reverses it. Peach reverses it. Oh my god! Referee's on a seven! If only way she can win the match by a count out! Can Peach do it? Referee's on the eight! Referee's on the nine! Isaac Cat is begging and she makes it! Isaac Cat made it back into the ring! She managed to get back to the ring before the count out. In that way, she will force her remove, remove her mask by a count out. Princess Peach will win this by a count out and force her to remove her mask right in front of the crowd. Oh, she's about to go for the Mushroom Kingdom, whatever that submission is. Oh no, not this way. Ah! Oh! DDT! Oh no, come on, don't tell me she's gonna lose like this. Oh, she lost! Princess Peach! She lost! Iris a Cat pulls the win! That DDT really knocked her out this time. Here's that DDT she did on the announce table by Princess Peach. She would have won this by a count out and that would have forced Iris the Cat to remove her mask. But unfortunately, right there with a DDT finisher, ends her with a three count. Iris the Cat wins and remains to hide her identity with a mask. Oh. It's something that we're hoping to die to see who is this mysterious Japanese person is, but instead, she remains to be hidden after her victory over Princess Peach. But what's going to happen next for Princess Peach? Who knows? She lost again. We haven't seen her win for a long time. Oh dear, dreadfully, we haven't seen her win for a long time, to be honest, people. Oh, this is a embarrassing moment like this. Iris the cat, as you can see, leaving the ring. 
and Princess Peach is on her foot. Uh, she's really depressed, and I can tell how how she's really feeling right now from that walk. The crowd's on her feet to give her motivation for Princess Peach. Her, her, she really tried her best, ladies and gentlemen. I can tell, and now she got some microphone. And don't tell me why I think she's gonna say. Wait! She's quitting? She's... Princess Peach just... She announced her departure! Can't believe this! A long-time person used CCW, Peach announced it, and, and here comes Daisy! And the, here comes to the Ram, and here comes her long-time friend! Oh, I can't believe how this is turning out! Here comes her longtime friend, Daisy. Don't tell me this is really a goodbye. Princess Peach announced her goodbye to the video game wrestling universe. After a two long season run in UCCW, don't tell me this is really Daisy's tell the crowd to give her a good motivation for Peach and and Daisy wants a hug from Princess Peach for one last time. Uh, whoa! Princess Peach just rejected it. I can't believe it. Well, this might be what I believe it might be true. This will be the last time you ever see Princess Peach here in UCCW.